Obsidian have finally spoken out about New Vegas 2, or at least, kind of. You see, the other day it was Fallout's 25th anniversary. In order to celebrate, Bethesda did basically nothing, which we spoke about in yesterday's video. But they did create a very short two-minute video of the original creators of the Fallout franchise, basically just talking about what it was like to make the very first game in the series. Which just so happens to be my favourite game in the series. Well, in response, Obsidian tweeted this. Happy 25th anniversary to the original Fallout, a franchise whose roots helped form us, and a world we truly love. And before anyone asks, our plates are pretty full right now, so no. And as disappointing as that is, we've got to keep in mind Obsidian, as I said, have a lot on their plate right now. They are currently working on The Outer Worlds 2 and Avowed, which I'm really looking forward to, and of course, open world RPGs like this take a while to make. And there was a little Obsidian Fallout leak all the way back in February, where Jeff Grubb said, and I quote, This is very early, but people have begun to have talks, and say these words in sentences. And these words are Obsidian and New Vegas 2. We're talking years and years away. There's at least an interest in conversations happening about making something like that actually a reality, end quote. Basically what I think he's trying to say is because Microsoft now owns both Bethesda and Obsidian, the possibility of Obsidian being able to make a new Fallout game is higher than ever. And going back to Obsidian's tweet about the Fallout anniversary, they did say our plates are pretty full right now. So, right now, you can't do it, but in the future? You're telling me there's a chance? Just briefly touching on what we spoke about in yesterday's video, it's pretty clear that the Fallout fans would love to see pretty much any new single player Fallout game, with Bethesda putting the finishing touches on Starfield and then of course working on the Elder Scrolls 6, it's going to be a hot minute until we finally see even a glimpse of Fallout 5. So of course allowing another company to create a new Fallout game while they focus on Starfield and Test 6 makes a lot of sense, and who better to do that than Obsidian. But obviously, as I said, Obsidian are working on their own games right now. Avowed, which I'm very much looking forward to. I thought the little teaser trailer looked amazing. I'm very excited to see how Obsidian handle an Elder Scrolls-like universe. And they're working on the Outer Worlds 2 as well, which I'm looking forward to, but I have very low expectations for. You guys know I was disappointed in the first Outer Worlds. I expected New Vegas-level stuff, and unfortunately we just didn't get that. But hey, it happens. I did enjoy the game overall, and I am looking Looking forward to the sequel, just trying to keep my expectations on Alicia Stein. Anyway guys, that is pretty much everything that I did want to go over today. This video is obviously a little shorter than usual, but as I always say, if we can cover everything in a short amount of time, I'm not going to waste both my time and your time talking about unnecessary stuff. If you enjoyed the video, please do drop it a like, it really helps out smaller channels like myself more than you can imagine. And of course, if you do want to stay up to date on Fallout, Outer Worlds 2, Avowed, and plenty of other open world RPG related discussions, consider subscribing because we cover it all over here. Also, if you haven't joined our Discord yet, please do. We have plenty of Fallout discussions over there. You can share your pet pictures, talk about life, movies, shows, visit our Not Safe for Work channel if that's your thing, and so much more, and we would love to have you join us over there. Anyway, with that said, thank you all so much for watching, and I really hope to see you in the next one.